Alright yo, what's going on everybody? You guys got the Barkage of the Hidden Gainesville. It's here today for another movement tutorial video. This time I'm going to be showing you guys how to do the uh, full planche press. Basically it's where you start in a planche and then you go uh, into a handstand <clears throat> from there. It's one of my favorite moves to train, one of my favorite moves in general, simply because of how gravity defying it looks. So real quick guys, I'm going to demonstrate, you got, demonstrate what a full planche press looks like. So here we go. <laughs> all right let me catch my breath real quick and i'm gonna explain these exercises all right that's the full planche press uh super cool move and so before you start training for this one you should oh my god i'm gonna die <laughs> you should have um you should have your full planche on obviously you should be pretty comfortable uh in planche <clears throat> before you do this so here we go with the first exercise. The first one is basically the negative uh, full planche press. Now, this can also be done, you can do negative straddle presses as well. Since this is a full planche video, I'm just gonna demonstrate the full negative. <clears throat> so with this one, you're basically gonna start up into a handstand and then you're gonna lower down into a planche and you're gonna try to hold it at the bottom. Basically, so you're gonna be lowering down and as soon as you feel like you're in a planche, this when you squeeze everything, Really try to hold it. Um, so yeah, here's what the reps will probably look like though if you can't uh, hold the full at the bottom because it, it is tough. So I'm just gonna demo what it would look like for someone who's maybe starting training it. So handstand, you lower down. And you would just bring it to tuck like that and you, would want to jump up and, and do it for reps. I wouldn't do more than three of these on the negative. So I would do maybe four sets of one to three reps with these negative uh, full presses. And if you can hold, if you can hold the planche at the bottom, just do it that way because that is a fantastic way to strengthen your planche. <clears throat> and uh, yeah, so the next uh, drill we have the half press, which is a very good way to kind of get used to pressing. So. With this one, you're also gonna be starting into a handstand. So let me show you guys what that looks like. You're just gonna hop up, lower down to halfway. Oh, <laughs> fail. Hold up. Just like that, I hope you guys get the picture. So handstand, lower down halfway, or as low as you can and back up. Obviously I just did the full press demo and then the negative and then that, so it, it cut me some slack on the demo, but that's what it should look like. <clears throat> and then the next one is simply just a straddle planche press. If you have your full planche, you want to do the um, uh, full press. And I'm assuming you can probably, you probably do have the strength for a straddle press, so Gonna demo a straddle press real quick. <sighs> All right, so that's the straddle press. Man, I'm getting a mini planche workout in this video. Anyway, quick recap, guys. We have the negative full press. I would recommend doing four sets, one to three reps on that. We have the half rep presses. I would say, again, four sets, maybe uh, one to three on those. And then we have the uh, straddle presses. I would do maybe sets of one on those. Uh, once again, this can be applied to straddle planche. So say you want to get your straddle planche press, you can do eccentric straddle planche presses, and you can also do half rep uh, straddle presses as well. Anyway, guys, I really hope you found the video uh, helpful. If you did, please leave a like, comment below what tutorials you guys would like to see next. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Deuces.